So this question says the volume of right circular cylinder A is 22 cubic centimeters. So first of all, uh, we have a description here of a right circular cylinder, but we don't have a right circular cylinder provided. So I'm going to treat this like a plug in picture question, which just means anytime a question describes something that can be drawn, it's a good idea to draw it. Right. And don't worry about your drawing being perfect. So what do I know about this right circular cylinder? Well, I know that it has a volume. So V is equal to 22. What is the volume of a right circular cylinder? Well, the volume for a right circular cylinder is pi r squared h. So pi r squared h equals 22. Then it goes on to say, what is the volume in cubic centimeters of a right circular cylinder with twice the radius, right? So let's say I had another right circular cylinder and it says it's twice the radius. So this, this radius is r, but this radius would be 2r and half the height of cylinder A. So if this is H for height, then the height of this cylinder over here would be half the height or H divided by two. Could also say one half H, same thing. So then the volume for this one, right, because we're going pi R squared, now my R would be two R squared, and my H would be H over two. Okay, so then when I simplify this, I would have pi. 2r squared is 4r squared, and then I'd have h over 2. This 2 here can cross cancel with this 4, making it a 2, right? I'm going to just take my number out to the front, so I'd have 2 in front, and then pi r squared h. So that's the simplification or simplified version of this. Now, don't forget, I already know that pi r squared h is equal to 22. So 2 pi r squared h is just 2 times, right? It's just 2 times this, which means 2 pi r squared h is 44. And therefore, my answer is choice C.